and then to get out to Malaya as quickly as I possibly can. Home again with his father and mother in the Kentish village of Hook Green, Kenneth Dancy was still very much in the news. And Tunbridge Wells had decided to honour the mate of the turmoil, the man who jumped to fame aboard the Flying Enterprise with a tremendous welcome. There was a civic reception for him too, and after the mayor had done honours, Mr Dancy succeeded in carrying out the difficult job of making a speech with flying colours. Mr. Mayor, ladies and gentlemen, that I should be so highly honoured in uh, Tunbridge Wells is rather beyond me. After all, I was uh, only doing a job of work for which I was paid, and, uh, well, I think if any one of you had seen Captain Carson alone in his ship, you, just uh, as I, would have... Uh, had the great urge to join him. And uh, I saw the opportunity and I took it. Of course, it has been pointed out to me that after all, this is leap year. <laughs> Following 